Hello, my little cherubs. So today, we is quite self-explanatory from the title. We're going to be making everything I'm eating is going to be from songs because I love music and I like food, and together, match made in heaven. You know when you always hear songs and then they say food things, and you're like, I want to eat that. I want to eat that. Now I'm preparing my breakfast right now, and breakfast actually I think would be my favourite song of all today that we are including so i'm absolutely buzzing for breakfast like. but um my the video with my dad which <laughs> somehow surpassed 5,000 likes don't know how but thank you oh my gosh i can't get the spatula out so the video with my dad will be coming but basically our days haven't coincided yet you know like he's been home i haven't been home or like we've been home for a morning and then we've been so it hasn't coincided yet. So that video will be coming, but we just have to find a day when we're both free together because he's a busy man. I'm not a busy lady, but I have to keep up to date with his busy man schedule. So we're just waiting for that. I am so excited for breakfast. You don't even understand. It's so interesting when you think about all the songs that have food in. I feel like food and music both provoke emotions and like, they convey memories from a past. So I think it's interesting combining the two, like a music will take me back. I don't know, it's just very fascinating. So combining the two is like a dream video for me. Ooh. So for breakfast, we're gonna be having banana pancakes. I've made some like syrup bananas and the pancakes actually have mashed banana in them as well. So this is gonna be so good. So for breakfast, we've got banana pancakes and we have got cold water. Now, I hope you can guess the songs. So, Banana Pancakes is actually one of my favorite songs because it really reminds me of my brother. My brother liked to play it on the guitar when we were children. And you know, when it just literally, if I'm on a desert island, that would probably be my top 10 songs that I could pick to play because it just really takes me back to my brother. And then I've also got Cold Water because Justin Bieber's song with someone. I don't know who it's with actually. But it is weird for you guys to see me drink from a glass because I'm always drinking hot water. So cheers to that. I'm so excited about these banana pancakes. I've never made banana pancakes like this. And with the like banana syrup thing on top. This is going to be so good. I feel like this is exactly, exactly what the song means. Because it's like when it's raining outside, you've got to have banana. There was a fly. You've got to have banana pancakes and be all like comfy. Mmm. Grace, you've outdone yourself there, my love. You've really excelled, you've pushed the boat out. So weird, isn't it, how food and songs can take us back? Bake can take us back to exactly the place where we listen to them. I just winged the recipe, so sorry everyone, I can't actually share the recipe with you because I just made it up. I've never seen this done before and I can't remember if it came from a viewer's suggestion or if I made it up. You know when like, it, it blurs together and I was tr trying to see if I'd find it on any of my comments? on YouTube, but I just couldn't find it. So I don't know if I made this up or if one of you guys gave me the suggestion. So sorry if this is your suggestion. Delish, 10 out of 10 breakfast, 10 out of 10 songs. Now I can't get the cold water song stuck out my head. Like if I say any of the lines from the songs or if I sing them or if I play them in the background, I'm gonna get copyrighted and the video is gonna get taken down. And I don't want that, but it's so annoying because how cool could I make this video if I could put the flipping songs in it? It's now 10.30 and it is mid-morning snack time. So this morning, we're going for a passion fruit from the famous song by Drake passion fruit um it's not actually in the lyrics but it's the title of the song so we're gonna have a passion fruit i actually have never just like sat down and tucked into a passion fruit i have only ever had it like on things um so i don't even know if i'll like it and it's so light i can't go over how light it is i got a mint tea it's in an underrated song by prince and it goes i got some honey and peppermint tea and get my groove on it's i don't think this song gets enough time to be honest it's quite a bop quite a bop okay okay <laughs> Oh, it's so sour. It's probably made my eyes water. I kind of like it. I don't know if this is obviously ripe. How do you know if a passion fruit is ripe? I think passion fruits have to be the weirdest fruit. Well, that passion fruit was a new experience and I'm just gonna, 
carry on with my day whilst drinking my mint tea. Guys, I'm having a real troublesome time here. I don't know what to pick for lunch. I have two songs and I don't know what to pick. It's a, it's a tricky decision. I am preparing lunch now. Oh, the noodles are... She's kind of bubbling up in this house. It looks like I've literally just sat here the whole morning, but I haven't, I swear, I've been out and about. Look what we've got for lunchy poo. We've got stir fry. Amigos, Migos, I don't know how to pronounce it. Migos, mm, I don't know. Um, so we've just got a classic stir fry, really. This one I feel like is a bit boring and I could have done been a bit more adventurous for lunch. Comment below what you would have done um, from songs. We've just got some stir fry noodles, which, a one big clump apparently. Stir fries are actually great, aren't they? They're so easy and nutritious and delicious. I feel like who's that who's that muck banger where well, she goes like this and she literally like sucks that all in one. <laughs> Here we have pudding. Cake by the ocean. Now I really, really, um, I really wanted to actually go to the beach, but the nearest beach to me is about an hour and a half away. And I don't have the time in my day to do that, unfortunately. Um, and this is what sparked my whole idea. I was gonna have cake by the ocean for a vlog. But then I was like, hang on, what if I did a whole, a whole vlog dedicated to foods that are the same as songs? There's also a hybrid of birthday cake by Rihanna and chocolate by 1975. So we've got like three songs happening here, but the main one is cake by the ocean and boy oh boy do I really wish that I would actually be eating cake on the ocean. There's nothing I want more right now than to eat cake by the ocean. So instead what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some wave sounds on and we're gonna sit and I'm gonna like, people always say that I shouldn't be on my phone when I'm eating. So instead I am going to not meditate but like actually contemplate things when I eat this cake. Oh my gosh, it's so big. Look how big this cake is that I made. It's massive. So let's get some wave sounds. So I'm really trying to zen out here and have a good time with the waves and my cake. But the dish was just really kind of obstructing this uh, nice time I'm having. I'm actually having a cracking time with the waves and my cake. Let me tell you, I've had this one, is the one that I found that I really like. Look at it, stunning. And the cake is consumed. And I shall see you later on for what is going to be next in the day. Um, hi guys. So I'm going to be making. Oh my gosh, I look tiny. Don't I look small? Um, so I'm going to be making American pie. Now I don't know what you're thinking. American pie? There's no such thing as American pie. By me saying there's no such thing as American pie, I mean when I googled the recipe, there was no recipes that came up, and there were like no American pie flavors or recipes. So I don't know if American pies are a thing. I know I'm probably going to get corrected in the comments, but you know how like there isn't an English pie. There's apple pie or there's blackberry pie, but there isn't a English pie. I don't know if it's the same for America. I couldn't find anything on it. Well, Grace is inventing her own. So I'm going to make a pie, and I'm going to decorate it with the American flag. I don't know how this is going to go, but we're going to try. American is pies. Yeah, but there's no such thing as American pie, is there? Well, it depends what the flavour pie is. No, that's what I mean. There's no such, like, American isn't a flavour pie. Well, I suppose, like, key lime pie. Oh, but that's got lime in it. This isn't that from, because it's from, in Florida. Florida Keys, isn't it? Yeah. I don't think it is. Oh, wouldn't you love to go back to Florida, Jess? Yeah, no, it is from key, the Keys. Is it? So yeah, that's why we had it in Florida. Which, if anyone, um, like any travel agents who want to send the Boo family to Florida, love that. I'm joking. <laughs> We've been abroad three times as a family, haven't we? So we'd love to christen. We'd love to take that to the big, the big four. <coughs> Jesse, what is a? I just don't have that pitch anymore. Jesse, what is a classic song about food? One that comes to mind. Because you're my cheeseburger. Can I add to a song? I just think they're not Spongebob songs. They're not songs. Oh, Happy Pat. Yes, they are. The, do you know how many songs there are about candy? Candy man, candy, um, because she thinks and candy. Jesse, when I did one. What? Jesse, that guy. Oh. What was that sweet oh. one that he did? That yes. Classic. Oh my gosh. Well, What's awesome. his name? Jesse, no, I can't actually spell his name like me. Car McCartney. Yes, what was it? Ready for it? I know. It's afternoon snack time now, and we've got two different songs. So the first one is, what do you think? Lollipop, lollipop. That one. Cracker for lollipop, and then we've also got a kiwi, which is Harry Styles' song. And fun fact, actually, so 
normally I would eat the skin of a kiwi like I just bite into it but I know that people get really triggered by that um, so I'm going to eat it normally and then eat the skin off camera because it's really nice, it's a different texture um, I'm not going to lie, I don't know why the song is called Kiwi I don't know what this, the meaning is because Kiwi isn't actually in the lyrics but um, I think it was his Manchester show I believe he actually the shops in Manchester this is just probably a rumour but I did hear that um, all of the like Sainsbury's and Tesco's all the supermarkets in Manchester had to stop selling kiwis because people were throwing them at him in his concerts so the one in like London people were throwing kiwis at him so they had to stop selling them that's a fun little story isn't it for me, and I've never met anyone that eats kiwi skins other than my family and like my extended family. So fun fact about kiwis, they have more vitamin C in than satsumas. And now we're going to have Mr. Lollipop, which I'm also very excited about. Hello. Mmm. I'm trying to do with this. Look at all these onions. I got refried beans and I love. I literally, I love refried beans so much. I don't think they get enough street cred, to be honest with you. Here we have cheesy enchiladas with onions and peppers and guacamole salad, um, which I'll put the lyrics up on screen. It's a Lyle Lovett song. Was he there? It's dairy free cheese, so it's probably not going to be the same. But they. It looks rank. I think it looks quite it looks nice, like plastic, Jess. Plastic cheese. No, but like the concept would be nice oh, concept, if, if it was yeah. real cheese. It is so good. Actually, I'm loving it. This is my poor attempt at a American pie. Is all the pastry shrunk? Where's the crust? Stars, stripes. Yeah. Bye, bye, Miss American make? Pie. I don't actually like pie or stewed fruit, but it's a song that I just felt like was very appropriate to make into a pudding. But Mum loves it, so Mum will eat pie forever. <laughs> this is apple and blue blairly. <laughs> Blue blairly. There's a little question for you. How do American pies differ from British pies? Sweeter. I know, this is... is... Sweeter, I reckon. I'm bigger. I don't know. Um, let me know down below. Oh, it's too deep. I, I feel, feel like this like is an American pie. This UK's isn't. I don't think. thin on the crust. Actually, no, it's how many... No, they normally have like some I sort of creamy pudding. Really well, let me know down below. American vlog. You should do it eating like an American. All right. I just look like pie. She's loving the pie. She loves it, don't you? I love a good pie. <laughs> I actually have decided that the one thing that I can accept in a pie is blueberry. Actually, I do like cherries. Apple and raspberry. And the apple, I just don't like stewed apple. Mm. Raspberry, but just don't need the raspberries. Mm. And then I also, I kind of want a slice of chocolate cake. I think I'm gonna have a slice. Don't do feel it. that do pie it. just didn't hit the spot. What song is for chocolate cake? Maybe. Chocolate rain, some stay dry. No. Uh, Katy Perry one. She knows one about cake, doesn't she? I actually love songs about cake. For the last snack under my sleeve. Some nerds, because it's candy. So many songs are like Candy Man, I Want Candy, other stuff. But obviously I had to get an American sweet. I mean candy. It's a real shame you can't input the songs. YouTube is I know, wow. YouTube. It be such a better video. It would be such a good video if I could be like, yeah. Dancing to it. But you you can put the script up. That's dead. <laughs> we'll just have the lyrics. I think the two of try and copyright. Let's see, but we're gonna have some candy. candy this is the only one that I can find in there. You know what it reminds me of? Christina Aguilera. Yeah. Candy. Whoa! I've ruined it. Do me to do it. I've ruined the concept. Yeah, do me to do it. Yes, please. It's a shame we don't have these readily available in the UK. They used to. They used to be a oh, UK gosh, sweet. I know. Do you remember when they were a UK sweet? They still are. No. Just not the they were like, how much? One pound something? I'm just going to pull it off the top. Yeah. I don't know what flavours we have in the UK, but the Americans always have better flavours, like cherry, blueberry. So where we've got blackberry, they do great. Where we have... Your bl their blueberry's amazing. Blueberry? Like ranches. Oh, Ooh. we... Love Johnny Ranch's the sucky sweets. Yeah. We're really having a reminisce about America today. I don't know why. And then ready? Oh, the grape just hit me. How much She's for the good. pack? Don't tell us more than a quid. I think it was like five. I remember when I was back in primary school. That's what I mean. They used to have them, but let's get them back. They are back already in some shops. Some selected really? news agents. 
selective retailers. You know the worst when you accidentally get like a cherry in the grape section and out of one and you're well, like... Well we've just kind of written it all off yeah. The green and the red are good. So that is the end of me trying foods from Sons. I actually had a really fun time making this one. It was fun to explore some new foods I hadn't had before. Never had enchiladas before. Never had banana pancakes. So it was a really good time. Um, let me know down below what songs you would have done. I could always do this again because I'm sure there were plenty of songs that I missed out. This was just a fun little video. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, as per usual let me know down below any video ideas you have and follow me on Instagram if you want to. Grace Booth 97. Peace out. You have a cracking rest of your day.